October 8. Our good is God's delight. I will make with them an everlasting covenant that I will not turn away from doing good to them. And I will put the fear of me in their hearts that they may not turn from me. I will rejoice in doing them good and I will plant them in this land in faithfulness with all my heart and all my soul. Jeremiah 32, 40 and 41. God's pursuit of praise from us and our pursuit of pleasure in Him are one and the same pursuit. God's quest to be glorified and our quest to be satisfied reach their goal in this one experience our delight in God, which overflows in praise. For God, praise is the sweet echo of His own excellence in the hearts of His people. For us, praise is the summit of satisfaction that comes from living in fellowship with God. The stunning implication of this discovery is that all the omnipotent energy that drives the heart of God to pursue His own glory also drives him to satisfy the hearts of those who seek their joy in him. The good news of the Bible is that God is not at all disinclined to satisfy the hearts of those who hope in him. Just the opposite. The very thing that can make us happiest is what God delights in with all his heart and with all his soul. These are amazing words. I will rejoice in doing them good with all my heart and all my soul. Jeremiah 32, 41. With all his heart and with all his soul, God joins us in the pursuit of our everlasting joy because the consummation of that joy in him redounds to the glory of his own infinite worth.